heading for a showdown. Two teams who thrive on pressure and performing on the big occasion. Now they get their wish. Fans the world over are fully focused on this atmospheric stadium where the drama is about to be played out over the next 90 intriguing minutes. Who will prevail? The story of the game as it unfolds, live next on EA... Hello everyone, it really is a football experience to savour. I'm talking about a visit to the Stade Vélodrome. I'm Derek Ray, and keeping me company here on the commentary gantry is Stuart Robson. And without doubt, a match with the potential to bring genuine excitement. It's France versus Germany. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Here's the side France will go with. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Kylian Mbappe starts with Ousmane Dembele in the wide positions. And the starting role in attack is handed to Olivier Giroud. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Marc Andre Ter Stegen in goal. Niklas Zule starts with Antonio Rudiger in central defence. Ilkay Gundogan plays alongside Emre Can in the centre of midfield. And the focal point in attack is Thomas Müller. Oh, Derek, big moment here. And quick thinking defensively. Well, you get the feeling so many in attendance here have come just to see this man, Kylian Mbappe. Well, Derek, when he's on form, when he's focused, he's a brilliant runner with the ball. He can take on players. He can go past people with ease. And he's got a great shot on him as well. I'm really looking forward to watching him play today. Oh, that's a really good run. But no damage done, that's the main thing. Promising move this from France. Pivotal moment defensively. Muller might still be able to do a bit of damage. Is it going to be? And you've just witnessed a moment of truly high-class goalkeeping. You're absolutely right. What a save that is. He's reacted so quickly. And short it is. Well, he loves drifting in off the flank. Well, that is how to play advantage. And deflected behind, so a corner here. And played in by Kimmy. Well, not cleared away completely. Very quick thinking there. Looking for the right angle. Oh, yes! 1-0 it is! And it doesn't come as a huge surprise! Well, here's the replay, and you see it was a good finish. But the keeper at his near post has to do a lot better. He's got to have that near post covered for me. So back underway. Will there be a response from France here? Dembele. It's with Giroud. Griezmann. Mbappe. Can he take advantage? Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long. And this match is level again. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. So back underway, they've levelled it at 1-1 here. So one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. And so there it is, the first half has come to an end here at the Orange Velodrome.
Well, who wouldn't want to have Kylian Mbappe in their side? Stewart, a key component of his team. Well, Derek, he plugged away in that first half, making run after run without too much success, but eventually he got his reward, and what an important goal it was. So, back underway, and an intriguing second half in prospect. Went in strongly, decisively. Oh, no stopping him. And he's in. There it is! A fantastic goal, and no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, you have to ask, where's the defending? The keeper is completely exposed, but he still had to finish it, and he did it really well. It's a good goal. Well underway again, it's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand. Emre Can. This is Müller. And considerable progress made by Gundogan as the attack continues. Oh, did so well to deny him. Joshua Kimmich with the corner and clearing his lines now can they hit them on the counter well with tackling like that the onus is on the referee to take action potentially and following the infringement a caution yeah no surprise there that was always going to be a booking And into the last 30 minutes now. Rabiot! And there it is, the goal they wanted for security. They lead by two now. They can breathe that bit more easily. Well, here it is again. Dembele's cross is asking for somebody to go and get on the end of it. But he's still got so much work to do. Just look at the strength he shows to hold off the defender and still get his shot away. That's a really good finish. So there it is. 3-1 the current scoreline here. Rudiger. Emre Can. Gnabry. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Griezmann. Now Giroud. It could be for Mbappe. Real chance. And still danger here. Well, it could have been, but for the offside flag. Gundogan Serge Gnabry and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end over the touchline for what will be a France throw and Germany regaining possession Gundogan Germany could get in behind the defence and ready for it is Leroy Zane oh a goal to reduce the deficit my goodness that gets the pot boiling it's not over yet well as this replay shows us Gundogan runs with the ball so well and it's a comfortable finish in the end 
which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Three, two it is. Who would have predicted that before a ball was kicked? Kunde. And the referee is quite rightly letting it go. How about the cross? A good and fair challenge. They're not giving their opponents any time to breathe. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. And the referee is going to add on three minutes. Kimmich. A super tackle and they've won possession. The crowd encouraging him to take it on. In it goes to increase their advantage. And will that be the goal that ends up securing it for them? Here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. Well, there it is, the final whistle, and France have prevailed in this one. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, Derek, it was a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today. Well, you know, I think Kylian Mbappe enjoyed himself. Your verdict on his performance tonight? Well, I thought he was excellent. Not only did he score a good goal, but his general play was outstanding. He certainly played a major part in their win here today.